grab a jump rope and discover how fun it is to jump your way to fitness. I'm Samantha Clayton, Director of Fitness Education at Herbalife, and I want to help you achieve a healthy, active life. Today, I want to take you through a fun 10-minute jump rope workout. But don't worry, we're not going to just be jumping up and down. We're going to make this workout fun with every bounce. Let's jump in style using varied jumping techniques and rhythm to give you the ultimate cardio and coordination workout. Now jump rope is difficult unless you're a kid, so don't worry if you have to stop and reset because practice makes perfect. Let's get going with a simple warm up. So hold on to your rope and you're just gonna warm up the wrists. Just a few turns each way. Let's warm up the ankles, turning your ankle one way, working on your balance and turning it the other. And then switch sides. Now we can use our rope for a little bit of stretching. So turn your rope in half, put one foot on the rope and all we're gonna do is just lift the leg up and lower it back down, lift up and lower back down. Just work in the hamstring, you can have a slight bend in the knee. Just warming up the hamstring, switch sides. Work in the hamstring, work in the balance. The core is always working whenever you go on one leg. Great job. Take the rope out behind and let's just stretch one side and then stretch to the other. Stretch over and stretch over. And let's just do some hip circles really quickly. And then we're gonna get to jumping. And now you're gonna see a lot of smiles because I absolutely love jump rope. I have my kids do it all the time and it reminds me of being a little kid. So here we go. Hold on to your jump rope. And like I say, I'm gonna stop every once in a while. If I can't keep up, you do the same. We're gonna start out with just a simple two count beat. So one, two, one, two. just a simple, simple jump to start with. This is the sort of jumping you do in the school playground. We're going to be jumping for a good 10 minutes total. Let's keep it going. You can go on the move. You can jump the other way. Keep it going. Now let's mix it up a tiny bit with some high knee. So high knee, high knee, high knee, high knee. I've still got that two count beat. One, two, one, two. But my knees are coming up front. Keep it going. Get those knees up. As you get tired, just lift the knees. Keep it going. Get those knees up front. Keep that nice hop and beat. A few more seconds right here. I'm gonna challenge your coordination. Okay, our next jump, jumping jacks. Just bringing those feet in and out, as you can see, it's okay to stop, just get right back to it. Just find your rhythm. Keep it going, feet are out, feet are in. Again, count the beat, one, two, one, two. Keep it going. Keep it up, double time now. Double time, just in and out for the last 15. Feet are out, feet are in. Next move, simple boxer, right here. 
you see them in the gym you see boxers doing this find your own rhythm feet are just coming off the floor but the ropes moving a little faster now so I'll encourage your coordination to get going don't be put off if you step on the rope just get back to it don't get flustered Okay, it's what I call my relaxed boxer because you know in the gym, boxers are never relaxed. Let's go, last 15 seconds right here. Fast as you can. A couple more seconds. Okay, next move, side to side hops. Side to side. Nice lateral move, just jumping from side to side. You can stay high like this, or you can get low, and then come back up, get low, get up. Just do what feels comfortable and have a lot of fun. Keep it going. Side to side, keep it up. You can do it. Let's go back to the classic jump, right here. Just over three minutes of jumping left to go. So we're gonna review our moves and then you get to do your own move for 60 seconds. So this is our double hop, high knees, high knees. So this is single time high knees, but you know I'm all about going double time, high knees right here, come on. Nice job. Jumping jacks, here we go. Jack it out. Single time to start with. Out, out, in, in. Keep it going. Double time jumping jacks. Double time, let's go. In and out, speed up the rope. Slow boxer right here. There we go. Find your rhythm. Ooh, as I'm getting tired, your feet get tired. Pick those feet up off the floor. Fast boxer. We're into our last two minutes of work now. Your slow box move. Let's speed it up. Let's be a fancy boxer. Kick the heel forward, keep it going. <laughs> side to side. Keep it going. Make those jumps big or small right here. It's time to pick your own move. I'm gonna be like a kid right here. Do whatever move you wanna do. Just have fun, mix it up. Your last 60 seconds. This is the old school ground one. Just mess around with the rope. But so long as you're moving, that's all that counts. Oh, cross feet. Hopscotch. <laughs> all old games from the schoolyard. Whatever you wanna do. Come on, let's go. Last 30 seconds. Keep it going, keep it going. For the last 15 seconds, maybe I will show off some of my jump roping skills. Jumping through the loop. As fast as you can, adding in a kick. Some crisscross. Some super fast moves. There we go. I hope you had fun jumping your way to fitness with me. Missing the rope and having to stop is not an indication of poor fitness. It just means your coordination needs some work. Each time you try this workout, you'll be giving, pushing your cardio and your stamina, and you'll be pushing your coordination. Jump rope might test your patience, but if you get frustrated, simply ditch the rope, 
and do my signature ghost rope move instead. Fitness is all about having fun.